Another closure, this one in Dallas, where a longtime barbecue restaurant served its last sandwich today. Nicole Nielsen explains why. We've been here a long, long time. It's the last time the open sign will hang on the door of Max Barbecue in Dallas. The last time owner Billy McDonald will hear these words. And my sides will be beans and fries. And the last time he'll serve customers he considers friends. How loyal can you be? I mean, if you're willing to wait out in this hot weather to get some barbecue. Max, known for its brisket, sausage, and sides, is closing for good after serving Dallas for 66 years. I'm here until I'm sold out. And word travels fast. A line wrapped the inside and outside of the building today, filled with fans who wanted one last bite. My dad took me to Max first time when I was 12 years old. So I was 12, I'm 61, you do the math. The closing had nothing to do with COVID or the worker shortage. McDonald says it's just time. Knowing that this is the best thing for me to do right now in my life. He's leased the building to a Mexican restaurant that will open soon. He says he still has his first dollar from their first customer framed at home. And he plans to be first in line with a framed dollar for the next guy. And that's kind of a good luck charm from a business to a business. As for his next venture, he's going to order some good old fashioned time off, but only after he's had his fill. I'm saving enough uh, beef for me and her to have two beef sandwiches when we close up. In Dallas, Nicole Nielsen, CBS 11 News. Over 60 years, well-deserved.